Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to connect a wireless or even a wired printer to your Mac. So first things first, you need to make sure that your printer is turned on and it is connected to the same wireless network that your computer is connected to. So they need to be on the same network. Then open up your Mac, turn it on, go to the upper left hand corner where you see the Apple icon or logo. Click that and then go to system preferences. This is going to bring this dialog box up here. And then the one that you obviously want to go to here is printers and scanners. Click on printers and scanners. Once you've opened up the printers and scanners box, you'll see here I have no current printers connected or associated with this Mac. So what you want to do is click the addition symbol here in the lower left hand corner. And then once you've done that, if your printer is connected to the same wireless network as your Mac, you're going to see it right here. As you can see, the HP OfficeJet 3830 series is the current printer that I have. And so I'm going to select that printer there. Now, once I do that, it's going to auto populate all of this information down here. The name should be whatever it is here. Location should be blank and the use should be secure air print. OK, so if you wanted to, you could even rename this printer by selecting the text here like this and then giving this printer a name. And then once you've renamed your printer or done whatever you want to do here, go ahead and click the add button in the lower right hand corner. It will set it up. Uh, sometimes it takes a little longer than normal, but if it doesn't, you're good to go. Now, what if you did not see your printer in that dialog box? Well, what you'll need to do is you'll need to go to the add printer option once again here. And then once this dialog box pops up here and you do not see the printer here and you know it's connected to the network, you know your, your, your Mac is connected to the network as well, go to the IP option, which is the middle IP option here. And then what you'll do is you will manually type in the host name or IP address. So in this case, right here where the address dialog box is, you will find your IP address by going to your printer, going to the settings, and there should be one. Uh, all printers are different, but it probably says something along the lines of network information, uh, wireless information, whatever it may be, and then go and select IP address and find that IP address. I'm going to throw up what that looks like on my printer now. As you can see, it is a string of numbers. Uh, again, I have that up on the screen now for you to see. And then what you would need to do then is if you've typed in the correct IP address, click the add button here in the lower right hand corner and it will work the same way as if it auto configured your printer in the first steps in this video. So that's how you add a wireless printer. Now, if you have a wired printer, it's very simple. <laughs> you just plug it in via USB to your Mac. It will auto detect the printer. Uh, go back here to system preferences, go to printer, and you should automatically see here under printers that one that you have connected because the Mac will auto detect and auto set up that printer. If it does not, there's probably an error with your printer or your device and you may need to just unplug it, restart your Mac, and then go from the start once again. Hopefully this video was helpful. If it was, don't forget to help me out by sharing, liking, and subscribing to my content for more technology tutorials and tips just like this. And I will see you guys in the next video.